Hello all, Dr. Fox back here again with sound this time. Uh, thank you all so much. I haven't got that many views for a silent one in quite a while. I usually don't miss my... Uh, I don't usually turn off the uh, audio. And then one of the times I do, I and then, and then I always go back and watch it to check for any real problems before I upload it usually. And... Go figure. The one time that I didn't, I had to get it up, up, uploaded today. It was I was having kind of a uh, long weekend, and I I just wanted to get it uploaded, and there it goes for doing that right for the first time. So looks like today this. All right. Anyway, let's get into our our weekend update. I can't wait to get some kind of theme to like plug in right there in that upload. That I'm trying to work on something. I, I I'm working on a few different things and sound and. Uh, a little audio, I mean, a little visual to come up. It, It's, uh, I don't know. I may not be able to finish it, but it's just more things I wish I could get done, right? Anyway, so, hey, Dr. Fox, glad to be here with you. Cat is over there in the window. Sorry, the other cat cam's not working right now. And uh, I've been a busy bee here. We had Winds Affair this week in real life. I got the kitchen cleaned up. That felt really good. And I, I was able to move some things around and I was able to get my mat put down or this little like plastic mat you put your shoes and boots on. I was able to get that tidied up. And one of my shelving units that I built, I, had, I hadn't had an opportunity to clean that up and I got all the things that were on it cleaned off and, and dishwashed and cleaned again because it had some stuff fall from the ceiling that had gotten onto some of that wear but i haven't really used any of those i only use those things maybe like once a year a few times a year so that's where i'm at with that and we we get to go to the winds of fair last week and uh it's been a busy weekend around here i got to finally watch i've been so excited for it uh on netflix now uh, they're not paying by the way anything that i discuss on here they're not paying me for any of this uh, i talk about it out of my own accord and so, a long, long time ago, it was a very, very special film to me, The Dark Crystal. And uh, I've been waiting a long, long time, and Netflix finally premiered there, The Dark Crystal, Age of Resistance, this weekend, on Friday. I was very excited, and I did a marathon, and it was so good, beautifully done. Ah, uh, I, I, the, the puppeteers that were involved, of course, he got his son involved as well from the original one. And, oh, of course, the Jim Henson, they were on board. And just, oh, I need to talk about that for a minute before we get into, to wow and, and all these other things real quick. I, I, I don't know. Maybe the Hensons would never see this, but, <laughs> or the folks behind the puppeteering, uh, that family. But I always felt like I, I, I always wish that I could be able to either puppeteer slash and or voice a uh, female uh, uh, in in that series. It would be so cool for like upcoming. I, I, I would love to be able to do one and a female that was born without wings in my circumstance uh, for those that know who I am. I always felt like that would sort of be the quintessential character that I could I could I could play in there just being able to be a, a female gelfling I think would just be phenomenal but anyway just just dreaming I wish right someone wants a fan that can do good artistry would like to draw one up for me sure <laughs> I wouldn't say no about that you know in tasteful uh, an animation and or uh, puppetry would be really cool Hi, yeah, we got to go to the Windsor Fair. I went on the, on military day. They allowed us to get my family, and usually I thought it was just going to be me, and that was really really nice of them. Uh, they were supposed to be putting up a plaque. I, I, I wanted to also check on my legacy uh, to see what I'd be able to leave behind I, when I served my country. So, and uh, I got a little more caulking done this week. Uh, I've got about. A uh, few more tubes left to get through, uh, caulking tubes, to be able to finish those. I got most all the ceiling cracks and corners and things filled in now. So, 
with that said, I let's see. Uh, why don't we segue into classic wow? So first off, I'd love to hear all of your folks' uh, uh, pros, cons. I wonder how many of you may have had nice, long patience to get through what we had. The old classic adage came up again. Welcome to classic or it's classic or you know, other ones. I want to send a quick shout out. We've been doing some some work with the, the guild. I'm, I met a nice new guildie. So uh, we've been able to level. I'll show you all those in a minute. I'll get over to that point. But on retail side, we've got the pet battle bonuses this week, of course, going on. Next week, of course, will be the time walking and Dark Moon Fair will start on Sunday. Speaking of that, that's what I was just finishing up in real life was we get to do Winds of Fair. And I came home and I've also been this weekend watching the nonstop Steven Universe, catching up on a few episodes I didn't see getting ready for the musical film tomorrow night on Cartoon Network. Again, I'm not being paid for any of this. This is just some some lists of entertainment that I've been enjoying. There's a lot of other Netflix series I need to catch up on. But I've been definitely checking those out as well. There's just there's a lot of things. The Trial of Style is going on this weekend. And I, I hope you all were able to kind of catch that. I was really excited through the D3 promotion. I was able to get Disney Plus for less than I think it was like came out to for three years like three dollars and ninety two cents ish. That I rounded it up. It's like three point three dollars and ninety one and a few other digits that when you round it up it'd be like three ninety two a month for three years. So I was very excited about being able to get that get that set up when that that doesn't launch until November. Some folks are in beta right now, so as well. Uh a shout out to Apes. I guess they completed uh Anixius. Anixius Layers World First in Classic WoW as well. I know I'm kind of jumping around here right now, but we're doing like classic and retail, a little bit of discussion on both sides. I guess now that I've mentioned those things in retail, we can kind of segue in. And I'm curious to hear how it went. It was an hour and 40 minutes. Uh, but my last thing before we get into classic launch on that, the last part I want to cover here on retail is I've been a busy bee. I have been leveling, trying. Now, many of you already have this. But for me, this is this is huge. This has been a long time coming. I'm going to eventually be able to, sh I hope, very soon, be able to finally get in WoW Retail, the Shroud of Cooperation. I'm so, so excited because I have been leveling up. I literally got to just finish. I just finished my priest this weekend here. Good old Rebecca. I never could quite roll my R's very well. My ex-wife, uh, she was amazing at it. But uh, I always wondered if her kids are, were able to roll their R's just as well as she could. And uh, with that, let's see. So as you can see, I've been plugging away my main up there. All these have been done. If you hear some noise in the background, that's that's the Winds of Fear still going on. That's going on until tomorrow. Usually it's a skeleton crew on Monday. There's there's still a few few little things that are going on. And I finished up my Paladin earlier this week, my Lightforge Paladin. It was nice to finally go back. I love playing her. She's she's a lot of fun to play. I finished the Priest this weekend. Uh, as you can see here, all I have left to do is my Shaman and my Druid. So once I finish those two, and I'm still logging in like every... Well, I try to remember every two or three days. I try to set an alarm on my calendar. But I still check on her. There's one more pet I'm still trying to get out of those little sh shrub rays that grow every three days or so. I got one of the two pets. I got to get the other one, but I'm still trying to do that. So I just got to get these two done on the Alliance side here on retail. And uh, now with that said, now we can officially jump back. And I'm sorry that I was bouncing around a little bit. I you know, Normally I would probably try to put some tags that would say, okay, I'm discussing this part at this timestamp and so on and I so I thank you for sticking around that have those that have we're, we're gonna jump right over here and uh, jump into classic so you can see what we've been up to so while this is loading I just want to send a, a quick shout out I'm not gonna say the individual's name uh, just for privacy reasons 
So I'm, I'm, I just want to say a thank you. We've been having a really, really fun time leveling this weekend on WoW Classic. So I'd love to hear your views is what I was starting to say from what your pros and cons was for the launch. And I heard, well, at least for me, we tried to get on the Horde side. And, I, and my apologies for those that were sitting around waiting. There's plenty of other great streamers out there, too. I'll, I'll plug away for them. I, I'm struggling. My computer had issues, and sadly, I couldn't. I was able to record some footage. It was like the first 22-ish minutes or so of some footage, and I uploaded that to share that with you folks on YouTube. Almost immediately, it was within 20 minutes. And literally on the, the Alliance server, when I was going to, to, to stream, I was going to get on here. These are my four for Alliance. I was going to actually stream. Oh, see, I have a, a realm full. Look at this, waiting time tonight. I wasn't earlier. And the last few nights, I've been really excited not to have uh, such a waiting time. And look at this. We're go we're, I feel like we're, we're going back in time. The first night, it was an hour and 40-minute wait. I mean, we were literally over like 10,000 positions at that time. And, li and, I, and I figured no one wanted to sit there. And yes, it was another Chica that was streaming classic WoW. But I did that for a bit. And then anyway, so then we got on with our guild. And our guild, I was going to show you. But as you can see, I'm in a bit of a queue here. So uh, I have three I have three on the alliance. I've been doing a female uh, orc warrior. She has blacksmithing and mining. We're, we're on Mankirk. That, that's the server we're on. Uh, it's east so that we get the best ping for on Eastern Standard Time. And it's supposedly a horde server so we're on Mankirk and we just met the cac the, the character Mankirk or we saw him as I was so ecstatic that we were able to make it to the Barons ah the good old Barons chat right uh, Barons Crossroads and we're just getting out there and we're just level 13 so that we could go take on the Ragefire Chasm uh, or at least attempt it we already have some of the quests that are available to get into Ragefire and I'd love to be able to get into Wailing Caverns eventually. Because I know these are coming out in phases. Whoops. So, I, and speaking of that earlier mention, I mentioned I'd love to be able to go to Anixia. Uh, they had that world first. There was no way I was going to be able to. And for kudos for those that were able to stay up and get like they, those that were able to hit, take off like a week and just level and just plug away at it i but it, this is this, this this these are the huge moments when not only are you on for a long walk ahead but i'm so ecstatic to get my first flight path and uh th these are big moments i mean compared to to retail it just doesn't seem the same and w when you're doing it me sort of going back to classic i mean the, 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 these are huge moments and to be able to get my first flight path now and i just set my hearth to crossroads and the crossroads crossroads like that song um to be able to, to we just reached that and i'm so ecstatic uh i was going to show you on the video if you watch my other one you can kind of see i show off the add-ons i got there was uh and i've got a link for one of those in one of my earlier videos is ralph frost Thomas, if i'm pronouncing your name right uh he calls himself frost but his channel is frost Thomas, and he had a great add-on set up that he, he had. It will say uh, the add-on's out of date, and that, that's fine. You can hit continue anyway, and it still works fine. Uh, because I guess supposedly they, they did all the work already. It's got Questy in it. It's, got, it's a nice UI setup. I really enjoy it. I'm really liking it. I'm having a really fun time. Those that go, it's not real classic if you're using Questy, Dr. Fox. I know. Okay, you, you guys do you. Let me do me so I can have fun. So, and that's how I enjoy it and have fun with it. And I, I, I have a lot of a great time doing it that way. So, and those that don't, that, that's great. But I just wanted to send you a shout out for that. We've been a busy bee. So I think, I think like I said, we got my Orc Warrior to level 13 this weekend. And uh, we'll be on again this week with our guild. I'm going to uh, slowly be moving myself towards Classic here to be working on these characters a bit more. Uh, I'm trying to leave that Warrior Orc for my guild so that we can level together and we can quest together which is awesome love being able to do that i have an undead rogue as well she started to le uh, level a few levels uh, sadly i know one of my all-time favorite classes is hunter in classic yes i know there's pros and cons for all these but
that's my that's the one I like troll and that I ended up doing troll hunter because you get a, a stat boost for that she's she'll have the uh, leather and skinning the rogue I know normally we would do something like leather and skinning with that but actually we ended up doing I'm gonna be doing goblin engineering and mining with my rogue actually and I was going to do a tour and a fourth one but uh, my brother's taking on the fifth character, and I just, I don't know, I'm, I'm doing so much. But as I try to, I'm trying to finish up, at least trying to get those characters over on retail level to 120, those last couple. I just want to get that shroud of cooperation un, unlocked and be able to maybe do a few time walking this week. I, I'm still trying to do like six total with my main and then my six alts. Oh, well, there's my main on my alliance and main on my, my horde over there on retail. And then I have four, five, four others, two, two, two more alts, two to four more alts on the alliance, and two to four more, so that I can not only I can also get rep rep those, those little rep points as well that 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 I can get for those. So I'm doing still a bit of that, but I'm slowly migrating, finding myself to coming back to class it a little bit more, and I'll be I'm more on a little bit more. I wish I could say that I, I could actually go get into have more streaming going on but i'm having issues with it connecting and i've tried to reset with the key and everything on twitch and i'm just having the awful time over here and this was supposed to be a new build but it's not quite as fast as i had hoped and uh i i, I now i gotta upgrade again pretty soon when i'm trying to hold out till black friday and i don't know if i'll be able to stream uh, just some of those types of rpgs i really like like the the pokemon series those know me that i do a lot of that streaming i did and uh i loved like the final fantasy style the the dragon warrior i'm excited for dragon warrior 11 is going to hit nintendo switch coming up here at the end of september very excited about that of course world of warcraft still on the top of my list i i always find myself coming right back to it um so uh, as you can see, the, I'm talking away, and the the, the 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 queue times are. This ended up going a bit longer. I I just I had more to discuss. To be honest, I started writing my next week's weekend update, and I wanted to include some of those other things I actually didn't get to say and talk about. So I'm actually very excited. So I guess I I think that's just about what I wanted to wrap up this week. Uh, I've been a busy bee. I haven't had an opportunity to level any alliance on the WoW Classic side, sadly, because I'm having my streaming streaming issues and whatnot. And, but we'll have to kind of see and play it by ear how that goes. And so there's been a lot. It's a Labor Day, and other folks I know their kids are back to school, back 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 school, baby, going back school, back to school, like the song. So, we, we've got all that happening this week. And I hope you ha get to have an extended Labor Day weekend. So, once again, this is Dr. Fox. Remember to take two weekend updates. Or, take two friends with you. Come on in. Or, just take you and another friend. Or you and a few alts. And head on in. Have some fun with the WoW Classic. Or if you're on uh, Australian Retail. Or if you're playing another game. I'd be curious to hear what you've got to say positively we hope to hear what you're currently playing right now as well or what you're looking forward to to also hear from you what your experiences were from the classic launch uh, pros and cons i'd be very very curious to see how that all played out for you this week as well i hope you got some resties or some of you that lost rest and just went on through and and, and plugged away or how you're all doing so far i'd love to have a few shout outs drop in down in chat and be like, oh, I just reached said level or I just read, you know, and, and this was this was big. It's ecstatic that with my war orc warrior, I was able to finally get like actually a green item. And this this is huge. I got a green axe and then I was actually finally able to start making and blacksmithing some actual green items. There we go. looks like we're just about under a minute. I was hoping to maybe show you guys guys gals and everybody in between kind of what i had excuse me i had here for characters but again we'll see what happens i'm dr fox remember to take two of those and yeah they got the pulls up there that's what that sound was right there cats in the window aka more the, aka more the explorer and we will see you 
next weekend. Or, well, we'll see, see you later.